I get what you're saying, but what about Ahi Ayman or what he says? Is it false or wrong? See, dear brothers, uh, I, wallahi, I wish him well, Ahi Ayman. And uh, I don't have anything personal against him. He's my Muslim brother, Allah. But what I said is that you can't give da'wah in the way that he's doing da'wah is not right. This is wrong. He says, I'm not a scholar, blah, blah, blah. Yes, of course, you're not a scholar. I'm not a scholar. We never said that you are, but you are giving da'wah. You are giving da'wah. The way that you are giving da'wah is wrong. That you are, your slogan, your approach is that I'm going to tell you about the, my past sins, what I've done before. Uh, and then, you know, and then warn you against that or warn you uh, from these things. This is not right. The Prophet wasallam told us to hide our sins, to hide our sins. He said, he said, كُلُّ أُمَّتِي مُعَافَ إِلَّا الْمُجَاهِرِينَ all my ummah is pardoned and, and safe, except for the people who expose their sins, who expose their sins. Of course, you don't do it out of boastness and, you know, like, hey, look at me. No, you're not doing that like that. I know this. But even though you're not supposed to do that, uh, give me any alim, any take. You have, we have to go back to our scholars and our, our seniors, right? This is how we have to do da'wah. We seek their guidance and their advice uh, to know what's the best way to doing da'wah. Go ask any alim. Tell him I'm doing da'wah, I'm exposing my sins to, to the people and I'm telling them that don't do this, don't do that. You know, we're warning uh, against these sins from my experience in, in sins and major sins, some of them. Some of them, you've done some crazy things. May Allah يعني, forgive you and forgive us. I'm not, I'm not an angel. Huh? I have also past sins, but I don't say them. You can give da'wah by saying good things. By the way, by the way, when you say... Like I've done these sins and I was in the, on the streets with gangs, things like that. This is kind of a promotion. Wallahi, I know you don't mean it. But when you say these things and then Allah guided you, what do people say? Oh, okay. Maybe I can be like Ayman now. I can do some things and then inshallah Allah will guide me later. No, no, don't say that. It's, yani, don't, don't try, avoid giving people that impression. So uh, that's one of the reasons why they say uh, to avoid such things, such approach to da'wah. Yeah? Fine, you have a passion for Islam, you have a passion to helping people. Yeah, seek knowledge. Seek knowledge. Yani if, I'll give you an analogy. If somebody wants to be a doctor, I, I love being a doctor. You just go and, I'm not a doctor, guys, but I'm just going to help here and I'm going to do this and I'm going to prescribe medicine for you. And they say, no, no, you can't do that. First study, get your, get your degree and then you can, you can practice medicine. Islam is the same thing. Da'wah is the same thing. We're all Muslims, good. We all love Islam, good. But when you want to come and step up and do da'wah, and no doubt this is a very, very high honor uh, if, you have, if you are sincere to Allah Azza wa Jal. If you want to do that, then seek knowledge. You have to seek knowledge. Before, before you, you speak about Islam, before you give da'wah, for anything, seek knowledge. Get your, get your knowledge right. Uh, you know, and then seek, me uh, seek mentorship and guidance from the ulama. Should I do da'wah? How should I do da'wah? Consult them, be close to them. This is how you should do. Wallahi, sometimes even one video. One video I do, yani, uh, I have to consult them. I have to t talk to my sheikh, my mentor. Sheikh, I have this issue. It's a bit controversial. Should I say it? Should I not say it? Sometimes he says yes. Sometimes he says no. Sometimes he says say it, but in a different way. We have to go back to our scholars, man. Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam qal al-barakatu ma'a akabirikum. The barakah, the blessing is with your seniors, whether it is uh, people of authority, whether it is seniors as in father, and whether it is seniors of scholarship and knowledge. So that's my advice to you. Do that, and inshallah, Allah will, will make you successful and you become a alim. You become a alim. And by the way, you've spoken about Islam before. It's not purely just, you know, life experience. You've said some things about Islam. You've said some things about uh, groups, sects. Uh, about Salafi, about that. And these things you've said, it's, it was wrong. It was wrong. And why, why was it wrong? Naturally, logically, because you don't have knowledge. That's why you, you said some things that are wrong. And no doubt, one of the gravest yani, violations is that you say uh, about Islam, you talk about Islam and you spread falsehood. Yeah? Some people would, would hear you now, but then maybe you correct yourself. Maybe they won't hear the correction or the rectification. You don't know. So best... To, to always say only the truth and with knowledge. Give da'wah with knowledge. Allah Ta'ala. No hard feelings, guys. Well, I don't want drama, but you have to preserve religion anyway. Sorry.